Like, you know, now that the groundbreaking is over, there's another word that's on a lot of people's minds, jobs. And Letitia Bush has been looking into that and yes. can fill us in on what's going on. Thanks, Steve. Absolutely. For the people who weren't able to attend this groundbreaking today, they're at home thinking or at work thinking, what about the jobs? Well, we all know that construction workers, they will be among the first people to get hired through Airbus. I spoke to HOAR Management Company, uh, Program Management. They're the ones that are going to be overseeing the um, construction bidding process. And they've told me the hiring process has already begun. But that doesn't mean that it's too late for you. Here's what you need to know if you want to be a construction worker. First, you have to pay attention to the announcements. I'm told that very soon now, Airbus or uh, HOAR program management will be announcing some contractors that will be involved in this project. And they're, they're the ones that's going to be in charge of the hiring. So you want to pay close attention to them. Isn't just We've um, put out contract uh, or bids, if you will, for architects, our two primary architects, several of the early contractors that are going to be doing some of the site work, the foundation work, and uh, we're on the edge of announcing those, and those will be the people that will be doing primarily the hiring in the coming days so and weeks. you know who they are? We know who they are. Well, we're close to knowing who they are. Some contracts are signed and the announcements will start flowing after the groundbreaking. Okay. So, as he said there, you know, the process has begun. They're being very tight-lipped about who's going to be involved. I try to get it out of him right then, but he's not speaking until the official announcement. So, you have to stay tuned to Fox 10 TV and Fox10TV.com because as soon as we know who those contractors will be, you will be the first to know. Now, coming up on your only local news at 530, I ask officials about local preference. Will locals have a leg up on the competition? Hear their answer coming up on your only local news at 530. Reporting live here at Brooklyn Aeroplex, Letitia Bush, Fox 10 News. I'm sure many looking forward to that report, Letitia. We'll see you in just a bit.